Well, hello, good evening, and welcome to Camilla and I. And um, we're at our holiday home here at Felbrigg Hall, the stable apartments and National Trust property. Absolutely superb. This is what we like to come back to. Some lovely warmth and uh, ooh, full on luxury because uh, oh, it's quite cold out there. So we do like our uh, luxury on Camilla and I on location. Anyway, here we are in East Anglia, uh, near Cromer. And uh, tomorrow, Camilla and I, we're off to Strumshaw Fen. So uh, in you go, Camilla. Yeah, we'll pack Camilla away for Strumshaw Fen. And um, located in this uh, book, Andrew Marshall, Photographing Wildlife in the UK. Great book, if you haven't got it. Well done, Andrew. And um, we're following his advice, and we're going to go to the Fen Hyde, Strumshaw Fen, which is 10 miles east of Norwich, at the village of Bundle, on the banks of the River Yar. So hopefully, by the magic of YouTube, and thanks to Andrew Marshall's book, I'll see you in Strumshaw Fen. Welcome to Camilla and I. And here we are at Strumshaw Fen. At least I hope that's how you pronounce it. Anyway, Norfolk, RSPB. Yeah, so there are little areas like this one all around the reserve. Just little gaps in the marshes and the reeds. Superb. Could be a bit in anywhere. Yeah, so the main thing that attracted us here today to Strumshaw Fen is the Marsh Harrier, um, as they're regularly seen here. Yeah, I did manage to get a few shots in the Fen Hyde this morning, so we'll link to a few shots. And a uh, magnificent bird. Love the Marsh Harrier. And uh, yeah, it must have been about oh, three or four around this morning. And I uh, literally just had one fly over a minute ago. Camilla and I, we've been in the uh, Fen Hyde for most of the morning and now we're just on this corner piece near the boot scraper and um, yeah, this is a lovely little spot and the reason we stopped here and I thought I'd record a bit here is because we just had a bearded tit um, so uh, yeah, linked to a bearded tit shot um, literally ooh, 15 metres from us here So Camilla and I are not going down here on our trolley that's for sure. So, uh, yeah. Of course, we'd love to see a bitten, but uh, yeah, we'll be lucky. Um, but the um, other thing that this um, Strumshaw Marsh is uh, famous for is the uh, Chinese water deer. And uh, indeed, we did capture a couple of Chinese water deer in the Fen Hyde. But also, just as I came out of the Fen Hyde, I did have one pose for me. So, uh, yeah, linked to one pose. Hopefully, that was in focus. Anyway, yeah, some nice pictures of the water deer. So, uh, yeah, there's some good stuff to come for if you don't get the birds. Well, I've got a couple of marsh harriers, one circling, and uh, one's just gone down in a tree. 
to the right hand side. Well, as usual, the object of the exercise is to get that winning shot. And indeed, that's what the whole idea is. We're always going for that winning image. And uh, anyway, the settings today on Camilla are, well, we're a uh, very nice bright day today. So we're setting a shutter speed between 2000 and 3200 for in-flight shots. And uh, I've put the extender on 1.4 so that takes us to uh, a wide open f5.6 uh, which we haven't deviated from at all because uh, it uh, gives us a um, enough depth of field and uh, otherwise the ISO will go up I think I might finish up here now that's scrumptious fen yeah it's been great great first visit so uh, yeah, definitely be back. Uh, excellent. RSPB Scrumptious Fen, Norfolk. So if you know the area, I've just been told that they roost at Hickley. And there's a, uh, it's about 10 miles from here. Uh, obviously not being local, I don't know where to go. Um, but there's also a chance of cranes or something coming in as well. So uh, somebody's just headed over to Hickley. Good move. Wow, what a day. Strumptual Fen and then ending up at Hickling for the Marsh Harrier Roost. And um, right at the end of the day, we got four cranes going over. A little bit of video of four cranes going over. What a finish to the day. And then that sunset at the end absolute sunset to die for oh great lovely to be back in the uh, warmth of the old uh, homestead here Felbrig hall stable apartments superb anyway planning for tomorrow now got the book out again well i know where i'm going tomorrow i've been here before titchwell marsh and whether we do the same trick as last time and we end the day at Snettisham because uh, that's where the large wading flocks fly off in the distance. 
and the large murmurations are. So, uh, yeah, on to tomorrow. But it can't get much better than today. Absolutely superb on Camilla and I. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow at Titchwell Marsh.